I just want to say I hate you, Giddy. That is all. <laughs> and I didn't feel like it. I'm not in the right headspace, but I'll scream anyway. It's okay. I'm, I'm not. It's not that bad. It's just okay. You can you can miss your skill shots. Oh, sure. You can use your 3A too. Alright, let's do it. I wish I did that damage. I just hope that there will be no lag in any of these EMs. I don't know, it's just something something tells me it's gonna happen. Let's see. Shut up, Giddy. I still hate you for this. <laughs> I didn't want to freaking scream. Peer pressure. I would show my camera, but I have shit in my hair, and it's it's like I have relaxer in my hair, and I'm also shirtless, and I don't even feel like showing any people any of that nonsense, so, uh, fuck it. But for real, though, I, I'd rather not show the, uh, like, my hair. Oh, but I hope everyone else is doing it. My damage is non-existent because I'm a synergy. Best synergy of my three since I'm using a scarecrow. My worst synergy, which is my Inquisitor, and the reason she's my worst is because she has the Tyrant under the sunset and does not have the elemental damage needed to make full use of it. So I'm gonna turn her into a DPS when the time comes. When I actually have like the resources that it should have had. Or whenever another like, you know, fast level up system shit, you know, comes about. Cause I'm not really liking I'm not really liking her as a weak synergy. Holy shit, did we just kill him without him transforming? <laughs> That's crazy. Oh fuck me. Oh well, we're gonna be here in a minute. Forgot to sell my runes again. I have to remind myself to make sure I, I get on that every single time I do this shit. Like every time, man. Alright, so we're going to sell, 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 sell. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't sell the ones I have too. Literally a free, a free extra slot. Let's get the weak DPS out the way, because why not? Check their runes. Alright, good. I'm glad I checked, because I was going to get so upset <laughs> if I didn't. Don't worry, guys. Just get through Just get through the first half. Just get through the first half, and I promise you it gets better. It gets better. Huh? Oh, 
Oh, hello. Look at all these sexy ass people joining my room. Oh my god, look at these sexy people. <clears throat> oh, you make me want to bring a Seder right now. Ooh. Any of you sexy dolls care to bring this Seder? Do some rune crafting, shall we? Just, just enough. That's all. My, that's all done. Okay. But this is where. Oh God, it's gonna eat my funds. Actually, you know what? Mm. Probably get, get the talismans out the way too. Shouldn't I? Yeah. Talisman crafting. Right. Now I'm out of gold, but it's okay. Also, any talisman that. Any talisman I don't need is like like, like level nine, 95 or whatever I'm getting rid of. All level 95 talismans can get the fuck out of my inventory. Please and thank you. I actually have a lot. I could have just did this instead of uh, crafting. I didn't realize how many level 95s I have. All talismans in my inventory must be level 100. If it's level 95, I don't want to fuck with you. I don't even want to look at you. Looking better. Wonder how to, how you doing, champ? Uh, finally, grinding on my man, grinding on man, getting tired, but thanks. Ooh, let me know when you, you, when the great purge begins. You can't keep this pace in new cap with all these faults. Type or two or whatever, got a couple more left. What's the plan after? You know, a couple of little you know, blah, blah, blah. Okay, I am so sorry. I know you probably said a lot before I checked, because... I don't really have my setup. I don't like this. Is all all my streams are on you know a laptop, so I don't have a dual monitor. I can't put chat on one monitor and stream the other. So you're kind. It's kind of like behind, since my um, system megaphone general chat is all on the right side of my screen. On that little bottom right corner is like a little spidget where I can see like some some messages. Like just now, I saw that you uh, did your low. I'm a terrible streamer, guys. It's okay, you guys love me for that for some reason. Holy shit, what am I doing? I'm like, can we please use my level 45 move? It. 
110 cap you know what i'm most you know what i want for 110 cap that i'm like really excited to look at i want to look at the sp optimization that's what i'm most excited about about the 110 i'm not it's not even about the epics i want to see how the optimization is going to be for uh the sp optimization is going to be because from what i saw online summoners which are one of which is one of my favorite classes to optimize their their build they're like one of my favorites because it's it's the tier two summons i really want to use the tier two summon because i always believed that they had such great potential so from what i've been seeing like the top 10 people the top 10 summoners um on the air uh arad sankey website or whatever website people go to to check you know the build for koreans from what i saw all tier two summons are maxed spirit sacrifice is also still maxed um i think the only sacrifice was they had to put big sis louise at level one and i'm like that's that's okay if if, if the trade-off means i can use all my tier two summons hey i'll i'll, I'll gladly do it I'm, I'm just glad it's not i'm just glad tier two is no longer the dead burger show you know or in some cases flame hulk but mostly just dead burger now all of them get now all of them get some love and i'm so happy about that i'm like let me see how this is let me see this damage increase bro let me see that so i'm ready also i wonder if 110 will make use of the time guide stones and like convert it into whatever the material needed to do uh 110 uh, hell mode would be i don't know if the time guide stones is going to be completely obsolete or if they're gonna you know, make a trading system where you can trade what remaining time guide stones you have left for material used for 110 uh, hell modes. I think it might be the latter. Something tells me it's going to be the latter. Yeah, way too much info in new cap. Really, they're 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 just they're just changing a lot of shit, huh? Well, are they going to fix the, are they, are they going to really put the G in DFOG or is this just going to be like regional? Like as most people are just playing. <laughs> Cause no one likes these, no one likes laggers and desinkers. Are they going to really fix that? Let's find out. I would sure hope so. Oh, hold on. Ha 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 ha. You thought I forgot. Uh, I can keep my... I don't have to craft any talismans. I can keep my runes. I mean, I can keep my talismans as they are, but I just need to craft some runes to make some room, baby. Oh, but I only have 219... Uh, oh, God. Actually, you know what? Let me do one more craft. I think that's enough now. I think we have enough space. Hero, I gotta bring you. You're the homie. My hero. My homie heroes here. Like, look at this guy. Can we can we just take a moment to just look at Hero here? Like, look at this guy. Oh, he built he built Gatekeeper. Ugh. 
words. He built Gatekeeper just like me. I'm glad. Glad to know that I wasn't the only one. Although he did the three piece Exotic Tropica, two piece Talisman uh, selection. I went for full Talisman because I love the speed and that's just me. But I love his build too. Here my, it, it's it's basically what I had deal, but I'm so happy that he also went Gatekeeper. I'm glad that I, I wasn't completely insane. Gatekeeper is OP. Yeah, it is. But weren't, isn't there like a, people were saying like there's like an issue about, you know, um, diminishing values when your elemental damage reaches a certain amount. I think they said it was like 250, but I'm like 250 sounds like a bit of a low number. I feel like you can have 300 or so and, and still get more, uh, more out of it. Than, than settling at 250. It was either it was either I get Gatekeeper or I got Roxy. I didn't want to be you know uh, known for just my 2A and 3A. I wanted to have some super high elemental damage. So my fire damage can clock in at around 317 to 390 something fire damage. Oh my god, I'm fucking dead. It doesn't matter because he's dead. Like, imagine having an elemental damage that can never go under 300 because you have Gatekeeper. That's what my Rhea is rocking right now, and I'm so happy. He's got the speed, he's got the damage, and he's got the speed. <laughs> it's the speed that really makes it. Because I, I actually do have the speed necessary to make War God uh, matter. Like, I, I have, I, I cap out at more than 120 movement speed, which I was surprised. I'm like, really? I hit that, and I'm like, holy shit. So Rhea no longer has a speed issue. He can he can move fast and he can hit strong. I'm so proud of him. Like, like let's let's take a look at him for a minute. Just just for just a little sneak peek. So this is what I'm rocking, as you can see. I don't have my, you know, my Ozma shit. I mean, it's not that I don't have the Ozma shit. I have these, but I don't wanna, I don't wanna wear these because I don't feel, I don't know. I just, I just, I just don't like them as much as the other ones. I wanted to have, um, despair and uh, what you call it, terror. But I hear Red Mane's also good, considering that I have, um, well, actually no, I don't have Assassin anymore. But considering that I want my lightning amulet to be at a super low cooldown due to my talismans and shit, I would probably want to wear at least the red main belt. But from what I was told, if you're gonna get a belt, you want the you want the belt to be despair or something. If you're gonna get like a if you're gonna get the five piece, the belt has to be despair. From what I told, from a DPS standpoint at least. All the other ones are just ruin, uh, Rosenbach, and another ruin. I hear Ruin is also good, but I'm not entirely, like, certain, like, someone, someone let me know, like, how that works, so. But yeah, this is what he's rocking. Uh, let me go ahead and switch over to Boral. I want to get my weaker DPSs out the way, since I know that people are bringing their cracked characters, and I'm gonna take full advantage of that shit while I strike while the iron's hot, you know? Alright, Hosting! Uh, who are you? I don't know if I don't know if I know you. I do not know if I know you. So I'm gonna I'm not gonna bring you. Harpy, no. Harpy, no. You the satyr. Oh my God, these strong ass fucking people. Guys, I need a satyr, please. You're all very sexy. I need a satyr, goddammit. Like, you see this? Ugh, I want this shit! You went for the Terror, Tiamat, I mean, uh, Terror, Despair, 
despair, terror, despair. So you have a you have a, a very nice blend here, and I like that. No problem, Wonder How To. I'm glad that you are here. I'm glad that you were able to do my some runs with me, and thanks again for always being consistent and showing up in my streams. You too, Anime House. I love you. Crunchyroll, all the way. Even though I don't use Crunchyroll for, you know, my anime um, adventures. I am so sorry, Envy. I know you don't like to hear that, but uh, I use um, I use GoGo -Go Anime for now. For now. It doesn't really. I mean, it, I don't think it. I don't think they give me ads. I know Crunchyroll gives me ads, and you have to pay for a service to, you know, have it be ad-free. But I know that Crunchyroll gets the shit first. So whenever there's a new drop of an episode or a new anime, Crunchyroll always gets it first. Look at me. I'm fucking advertising Crunchyroll, and I'm not even sponsored by them. Like, what, what the fuck? Why is your pet named Press V? Is V your uh, pet skill? Because mine is, um, I think mine is the right shift key. I see. This is a train. Bring your alts. Lurk in stream. Twitch.tv slash swift for where I am done. <sighs> Let's go. This is gonna be a slaughter. Every single one of y'all is jacked. But I'm gonna do my best to contribute. <laughs> In case anyone wants to know. That's my gear. So we go. But I did do a little bit of upgrades on Boral. Um, his talismans are best in slot. And he, has, he actually has a Capella Stigma for all of them. The only thing I am missing is the Nine Barrels uh, Blue Talismans. I mean, Blue Runes for all of them. Everything else is uh, Ornate and Good Runes. So, yeah. I just, I just need the blue. I just need the blue. I can't fucking see. Look at me, I can't even fucking do anything. Whoo, you see that range? Ah. Ah. Range. Hi Rev, 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 hi Rev. How are you doing? Ow. Can you please? Thank you. Uh, oh. Bada bing. Boom. That actually did some damage. Like there, there, like there is potential in the characters that I make. Otherwise, why would I make them? It's just that. It's all about priority. Who I who I'm trying to upgrade first versus who else I'm trying to upgrade. Right now, I have been able to upgrade Jaskira. Um, there's only the there's only the issue with getting the remaining enchantments on her because it was a process to try to get the best in slots for everything. Like like I guess the best in slot or the second best in slot. For all of her enchantments, because that, that that's how I upgrade, by the way, guys. I don't just give them the some run-of-the-mill enchantments. I give them the best of the best, because I care about them that much to do that. Upgrade more satyrs. Uh, yep, Seraphonite is still someone I need to upgrade. You know what's funny? Seraphonite has all the tools needed to upgrade. I just have not gotten to it yet, and I know I'm just so fucking terrible. But I have gotten Yachi, so I'm, it's not like I'm not doing it, guys. I am upgrading. It just... It just takes a minute, okay? It's, it, just, it, just, it just takes a minute. You got events, and you got all the shit, and you got real life shit, and, you know, stuff, blah, 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 blah. Ugh. It's a process. But I promise you, it, it's coming. 
All right, um, Erisio. I don't think any. I don't think anyone saw Erisio last time, but yeah, I updated his avatar set. I fucking love this look. It's just beautiful. And as far as I'm concerned, I am the only person as of right now who is wearing this hidden avatar set on an Avenger. Because you know, like, like if you put it on an Avenger, it's like you know, what's the point? Because the moment you use your one A, you can't see it no more. But it's 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 the principle behind why it's so cool. It's the principle behind it. Oh my god, there's some fucking my ass people. Look. Whew. Like, god damn. Surely one of you sexy beasts have a satyr. Or we can go satyrless. You're all strong. I'll leave it to you. It's sacri it's sacrilegious. Avenger only needs the clown briefs. <laughs> you talking about the uh I think I have it on him, don't I? Do I? Do I not have the Great Soul Avatar set on? Oh yeah, is it, is it this here? Baby is Priest Neon Red Diaper? How do I look when, when I have that? And nah, I'm not a, not, not a fan. I, I, gotta, I gotta wear the pants. Gotta wear the pants. Plus my Avatar set. My rare Avatar set commands that I keep it traditional. I like this. I also gave myself cocoa black skin because it just looks so good on this motherfucker. It looks so good. I just can't help it. I hope a satyr comes though. Ooh, up, 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 up. Okay, my talisman is good. All right, I'm good. I'm good. First time viewer from Weak Bullet says, Hey! And how you doing, Weak Bullet? Thanks for stopping by. Feel free to follow if you want to. If you want some inconsistent... If you want some inconsistent ass streams where I can stream anywhere from tomorrow to next month, by all means, feel free to follow. But, I will say, it is quite entertaining when I do stream. So, uh... Follow at your own risk. By the way, been a while since I've seen you stream. How you been, bro? Yes, K1, I have been doing... I've been doing... Okay. I would love to say that I am on the top of my game right now because I would love to say that I had the greatest job in the world, a job that paid very well, a job that I mastered on day one, not mastered, but a, a job that I got the ball rolling on day one, and a job that I actually found out that I was doing really good in, and I was actually one of the best people, if not the best on my team. I would love to say all of that to you. I would love to say all of that to you, but alas, I cannot, because I am no longer with the company, because I was terminated. But... Your boy's trying to hang in there. Aren't you in a call center? I mean, not really. I work from home all the time. All the time I work from home. Um, but alas, the last the the the, uh, the last good job I had, I unfortunately messed up. But they did. Uh, I, I did get a text from my uh, team lead who said that in six months I could apply back and they would let me back in. However, that's what she's saying right now. I'll see what happens in six months because if I actually do if I if they give me another chance and they let me come back I will be the fucking happiest motherfucker in the, in the world and I'll never make the mistakes that costed me that job ever again it, it, it's a long story I don't want to go too much into it but let's let's say like you know guy has great job guy accidentally screwed up 
like my like my, my call quality was not you know up to the standard but they know that I'm good it's not that it's not that I'm just any random person they know that I am good they know that I can do it but if if my calls are not showing the results of what I'm capable of then unfortunately they have to make the executive decision and you know let me go so I don't blame them for letting me go it's just unfortunate that it had to happen I really like like when when they when they when they when they got when I was in a call with them and they were like you know hey Chima I really I want us to take a take a look at this call and tell me what what you think went wrong and when I heard it when I heard the call and I'm like wait I I set this appointment no this appointment is complete as and they told me yeah you set this appointment two days after your 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 final you know like your written warning. And I'm like, there's no way I set that up. I'm like, I, I was in disbelief. I'm like, there's no way I, I set this appointment. And I'm like, I, I don't know. I guess some, something in my brain just told me that, you know, I can't take no for an answer because I'm a very competitive person when it comes to that job. Because I, I know if I know I'm doing good in it, I become very competitive. And I think, I think my over competitiveness got in the way of good call quality. Because it's better to have little conversions, but all of your conversions become very qualitative, than have a lot of conversions and have your and have people's eye on you wondering like, hey, this guy's making oh, this guy's like doing way too many con like this guy's making like above average conversions. We need to see like what's up to see like are all these conversions like qualitative? And unfortunately, not all of them were to my to my you know unfortunate surprise. And you know they had to let me go, but if if I'm able to come back, I I'm gonna be a you know a changed person. That job that job is way too good for me to lose it in, in such a blaze of glory. Like I, I I only was in I was only there for like four months, you know, and it only took one month for me to really get my foot and to get my foot across. I was offered different promotions because they knew that I was doing good. They know that they know what I'm worth. Like they they know that I can do it. It's just I got to make sure that when I'm actually in these calls, I apply what I know to these calls and I don't let I don't let competition or I don't let, you know, whatever it is that get, that goes through my head, I can't let it cloud what a, I can't let it cloud my judgment. If a, if the customer says that they have a 6 if, they, if the customer says clear as day that their credit score is under 650, do not set the appointment. Do not try to ask them more questions to see if you can weasel your way into making them say that they have an average credit score because that's one that 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 counts as a failed call. If they if they ask if you have a 650 or higher credit score and and they say no, you don't like that 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 that's the end of the call. Do not say anything further. Do not ask, "Oh, well, maybe would you say that your credit score is at least average?" I did that because I believed that I could be able to do that. Like I thought that I could honestly ask that question, but no, you cannot. If they if they say on a recorded line that if their credit score is under 650, then you can not fucking set it. So it's 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 like it's like little rules like that that I need to make sure I abide by, and I need to know when to just let a call go, even if I'm behind on conversions. So be it. Do not let the prospect of hitting hitting your quota get in the way of a good quality conversion. It's better to not meet your quota, but have all of your uh, calls be qualitative and error free, than always meet your quota, but have some of those calls not be good. You know, good like like have those quality calls. It's better to okay. What am I? What am I trying to say? Cause like I had it and then I lost it. It's better to have low conversions, but have every single one that you did be qualitative, than have high conversions, then and have all of and have a, a high chance that some of those may be failed calls. So by God's grace, in six months, October, October 19th, on October 19th is when I'll apply again. Until then. Any job that I have, any job that I have after that is just going to be a job. Like, it's nothing that I'm, that I'm really going to, you know, like, look at to be something great. Because 
I had a great job and unfortunately I lost it. So how, how can you, how can you recover from that? Like I legitimately cried when I found out that I was terminated and I've never cried at, at, at the loss of any job except for this one. So what does that say about that job? And it wasn't even like, like all my other jobs, when I got terminated, I know that what, I know that I was doing something bad. Like I was doing something bad because I was trying to like cheat the system. But this job, I legitimately was not trying to cheat the system. All of my mistakes were real honest mistakes because I thought that, you know, it would, I, I didn't think that it would be a bad call. And uh, I just, I just made too many mistakes. But I made too many, I made too much damage um in a, in a small period of time i made too much i ma i did too much damage in a small period of time where um where uh what am i trying to say i did too much damage in a small period of time where it doesn't even matter where my mind was at going forward because i was trying to really get my numbers up because that I was because when you're on a 60 day you know strict supervision of all your calls they're looking at every single call you make and one mistake costed you can cost you and it costed me so now I have a new job can 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 hardly remember the name but I I start like I started today but it just felt off being there Hopefully tomorrow will be a little bit more, you know, understanding. Um, I'm not going to go into detail about the new job because I don't, I honestly don't expect to stay here. Even as of right now, I'm still applying to other jobs as we speak. But the only reason that I want to keep it for now is because I gave this apartment complex that I plan on going to. I gave them some. I gave them my new hire documents to let them know that I am employed. Because if I wasn't employed, then I wouldn't be trying to, you know, go into this uh, Kensington Square apartment area. Like I, I can't, I can't, I can't stay in this house constantly, you know, get, getting a job and losing a job and disappointing people and myself. I don't want to put myself through that, so. I'd rather just go through, you know, life and not feel like I'm being babied because my brothers think that I'm being babied in this house and I don't want to, them to feel that way and I certainly don't want to feel that way. I understand that I live here, you know, without having to pay any rent. I mean, not rent, but without having to pay any you know, bills and stuff like that, but I don't think I'm doing myself a mental good service by staying here. I'm not learning. I'm not learning the, the things that are needed to keep your head in the game when it comes to having a job. Because if I have an apartment and I have a job that where my livelihood and my apartment depends on that, best believe I'm not gonna be making any more mistakes. It's easy to make it's easy to fuck up and make a mistake when you're in a when you're in a household where it feels like a safety net, you know? So let me let me t let me put myself out there. Let me go out there and let me, you know. Let me let, let let me let me live. You know what I'm saying? Like let me let me get out there. Let me um, put myself in a situation where I am left no choice but to succeed. I think maybe that'll get my head in the game, so that way I don't make these kind of you know tragedies. So yeah, that's uh. That's, uh, that's it. Sinclair Hair, I'm sorry, I, I never did say hi to you. How you doing, champ? I'm sure you're probably gone now, but if you're not, how you doing? Yeah, sounds like most contractors. Uh, yeah. I used to work at a call center in college, um, but it wasn't for me. Haha, <laughs> no worries, bro. I don't know if you remember me. I got banned from Nip's stream. Oh, you were the person that I talked to. You're you were the person who was saying that weird stuff from uh in uh Slippery Nips channel. Oh. Uh as long as you from it you good. You learn. Yeah, this I this is definitely a learning experience. And like like I said, it is it is with God's grace that I come back. If I come back to this job, 
I'm a changed man. I will be the best. I will always make quality conversions. I will not let greed get the better of me. I will let a call go if I know that it's not going to qualify. I'm not going to I'm not going to use my gift of gab and try to make it seem like the call is legitimate when I know it it, it most likely will not work out. So, it's it's not about it's not about having a conversion, it's about having a quality conversion. Now a quality conversion is different from an average conversion, you know what I'm saying? Weird stuff. I just said intro stream. Oh, yeah, well, you know, you don't get, like, I'm not a speedrunner. I'm not a speedrunner, weak bullet. I'm not a speedrunner, but I can kind of get an idea of where their mentality is when you do something for so many times. Uh... Oh shit, I just realized I'm on him. No wonder. Oh, I'm not gonna do much damage, am I? Oh shit, I don't have any elemental damage. Oh fuck. Oh yeah, so yeah, th this this is Yachi. This is his upgrades. He's gonna wear three piece uh, Mother Nature, two piece talis two piece uh, talisman selection. I mean, two piece uh, crossroads. Lucky Triangle, and my mythic is the Time War, so he's gonna be uh, super fast, super fast, you know what I'm saying? Super fast. I need a big Seder to, to, carry, to, to, get, uh, to continue this one. Um, but yeah, I'm sure this is your first, in fact, Weak Bull, I'm sure this is your first time uh, seeing this kind of game. This is Dungeon Fighter Online. This game is fucking addicting. When you actually get the ball rolling, I have I have a friend here who recently got into this game and he he did not hesitate to spend a thousand dollars. He got his character geared like a motherfucker. This shit is geared. He's end game. He spent the money to make the money. He's geared. This game like when you understand how this game works. Oh my god, you will you you'll 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 see you'll see you'll see. But play the game, you'll see what I mean. All right, Big 17s, EM train parts. Looking for a Seder to resume runs. Anybody want to sell EM? No, but you can join me instead. Uh, stop trying to join my party. Your fame is ass. You're probably a bot. Look at your name. Your name is random. Your Explorer Club is random. You have only three characters. You have not done any any. <laughs> you have not done any end game content in your fucking life. And your gear is rental. Trash. I mean, I know mine is not good, but at least I'm trying. You know what I'm saying? <gasps> oh my god! Oh no, the guy left. What the freak? Uh, not you. Okay, uh, replacement. There you go. Appreciate. This character is upgraded, but a work in progress. For now, Yachi is weaker than what his old build was, but when I get my shit up, when I get my shit amplified, and I get my best of slot enchantments, then <laughs> you gonna see. You gonna see. You gonna see, baby. Uh, yeah. 
correct. 309A PMI to be exact. Whoa! Yeah, pretty busy at work, but I'm definitely gonna try it. Seems cool. It definitely is, buddy. I fucking should have. I fucking should have made you. Um. Okay. So. Okay. So weak bullet. So there's an event going on right now, which is actually good for newbie players. If you can get a person who has already played the game, which are basically like veterans, basically anyone who is not a noob. Like, now, not, I'm not trying to use noob in like a disrespectful way. I mean, like they're, they're literally called newbie characters. So there's an event right now where you can get like special goodies, like really good stuff to get your, you know, shit going. As long as you add an explorer club name as a veteran. Um, you you can check you can check it out for like more details if you know the main website. It, it, the main website is DFO Neopole. That's N E O P L E dot com. Again, DFO. Neople, N E O P L E dot com. All the events will be shown there and all the details are there as well. But just to like a summary, you'll see this little megaphone UI right here. It's called Newbies Always Welcome. We're on season three. Veteran Adventure. Enjoy DFO by becoming friends with newbie adventurers. Get rewards by accepting friends up to three times. I already have my people, but I could cancel one of them to bring you in, Weak Bullet, if you want. But I got I got my guys here. They're they're doing their their mission, so they're giving me my shit. And then you guys have your own newbie missions that you can do as long as a veteran like me is doing their content. As long as a veteran player is online doing their content, you get rewards basically. As long as you are online doing your content, veterans get rewards. So it's kind of like you know, back and forth. Help me, I help you, kind of shit. It is really good. It is really correct. I would highly recommend it. This is fucking amazing. Think of this as a 2D version of Risk of Rain 2. Like all the all the damage numbers and shit, like all that. Like you, you see this? Like this this is this is what you're looking at. Now, I will say there are some problems with this game. For instance, the lag, I swear to god, I did it, didn't I? I oh I fucking did it. I did it! I did it! I did it again! I did it again! I forgot to sell my runes! Now I'm gonna be stuck here, having to sell all my shit because DFO is programmed where if there's anything, if there's anything like this dropping in the end of a dungeon, you can't leave unless you close the game by force. So fuck me, I have to sell some runes. But it doesn't even matter, honestly, because as you can see, as you can see with my talismans and runes, it don't matter what runes I get anymore. Until runes become tradable, it don't matter what I sell, so... I don't give a damn what I fucking sell right now. Sell, 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 no... Sell, sell, sell... Just keep on selling until you don't need to no more. I don't give a damn what I'm selling. I really don't care. I'm just selling whatever is fucking here. Just sell fucking anything. Okay, we're done. Alright, we're done. Give me my rune ores and now I can leave. Cool. But what if neither is online and or not playing? Mwahahaha. <laughs> well, that is not going to be me because as you can see, wonder how to from my Explorer Club info i have over 1100 consecutive logins so leaving is not an option not being here is not an option i will be here every fucking day every fucking day every fucking day newbie newbie adventurers who add my explorer are guaranteed to get their shit guaranteed uh let me choose l'oreal she needs to do her content wait hold on what round am i on I think I need to bring my Seder out. Yep, I'm on round 10. Alright, time to bring out my Seder. Every five rounds, I bring out my Seder, because I do this 15 times, baby. 15 times. Now I wait. 
17k is basically 17k blech words 17k fame is your is the is the game's way of telling you how geared the person is so based on this guy's gear he's 100 and thousand percent end game 17k means you're a fucking whale you spent money to get your shit to where it is there's there's a very high chance that you did not get this for free high chance 12 12 13 14k is also above average 12 13 14k is above average uh 10 10 to 9k is average honestly like i would say like i would say like 10 to 11k fame is average like you 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 have epics on but you know you can there's definitely some ways to go for improvement 14k and above you most likely have amplified end game gear like it's not just end game gear it's amplified end game gear which gives you more stats so for instance let's look at uh one boy nine here Let's look at this here. You see that plus 11 right there? Plus 11 unconscious selection, which means it's an epic, but he amplified it up to 11. So with uh, with amplification, that purple text you see there, his strength goes up by an additional 103 on top of uh, what he has right now. So that, like, when, when, when you see how damage is calculated in this game, that shit means you are thick and thick. Badass boy! And then runs become as fast as this. And I did not mean to do that. Yeah, so if you're if you're familiar with if you're familiar already with playing with like playing games like Final Fantasy XIV, where you can tell a good character from an extremely guild ca geared character, one uh, player two here is definitely fits the bill of this guy's a fucking whale. He he has money to spend, especially when you have multiple alternative characters who also are you know as geared as that one. Mine ain't really up. Mine, re mine ain't really there yet. Like, I have the amplification, but mine are plus zero, which is why you don't see, like, the plus number there. It's amplified, but it's just not, you know, it's not there yet. It takes a lot of resources, and uh, the, that resources can end up running out very quickly. And also, by the way, it's also RNG. Amplification is 100% guaranteed to succeed up until plus eight no up until plus seven once you get to plus eight and higher there's a chance of failure if you get to plus ten and higher if you fail your uh, enchant if you fail your amplification enchantment you break the entire epic which means the epic is just gone everything about it gone it's gone poof so uh Amplify at your own risk, or if you're a fucking whale, you can buy a ticket, which is guaranteed to, you know, have a 70 to 100% chance of succeeding. And even if it does fail, as long as it was from a scroll, uh, the, the, the only consequence you'll have is that it resets back to zero. It won't break, it'll just reset back to zero. So better that than it breaking. So yeah, I know I hit you with a bombardment of information that you're like, what the fuck is he talking about? But if you invest in this game and what it can teach you, you will quickly understand. Then again, I've been playing this game well since fucking 2008. <laughs> I played this game for a long while. This game, this game has existed for a long time. It's just now it's ran by a company who will actually give it some tender love and care. And I'm happy, and I couldn't be happier. Let's go, baby. Alright, back to my DPS characters. We 
We are now on part 11. And now we wait. 13k, pretty good. I would probably bring this person because he is a newbie and with the event that I mentioned about the newbie uh, character, if you if you do content with a newbie character or at least someone who is an event character, since we have a new class coming out, I mean not a new class coming out, but we have a new class that is out right now called the Blitz, which is the fifth and final subclass of the male gunner. Uh, when you actually check out the uh, the list of characters and classes you can make, uh, you do content with them, and uh, yeah, you get rewards. Uh, but I mean, how how strong are you? How strong are we both? We need to get a really fat ass satyr. Okay, you can just leave then. Okay, that works too, I guess. Fuck you. Okay, so now that's a big satyr. 15k? Fame? Hell yeah. That's a nice saver. At this point, we could afford to have a newbie. Oh, he said he was going to swap Seder. I thought he just left just because. Okay. Okay. Uh, sure, why not? Oh shit, I'm so sorry. This guy's my friend. I will always I will always prioritize my explorer friends over <laughs> over randoms. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Explorer friends come first. No, please, randos needs the randos need the help more. Uh, I I know, but I mean, look at he's 13k fame. He's 13k fame. How can I how can I say no to that? And he's an explorer, and he's an explorer Flynn, and he's a guildy. Like, how do you say no to that? He's strong. He's a guildy. You know him, and he's uh he's an explorer friend of yours. I used a very strong move by accident and it didn't even hit anyone. I'm upset. That messes with my rotation.
No, I fucking missed again. Uh... <sighs> Black? Oh. Yeah, okay, there is lag, fuck. I mean, a little bit, just a little bit. A little bit of lag, but I can still connect my hits, so. Oh, shit. Okay. There's like a slaw, like, like a small delay in between our attacks. Pretty sure, I don't actually don't know who's causing the lag, to be honest. I like spaced out for a minute. <laughs> Shit. Uh. Oh, okay. Good. Now I now I, all I need is a Seder. So big seventeens. EM train parts. What am I on? Eleven out of fifteen. Looking for Seder to resume runs. And uh, nice twitch. Plug because who's gonna fucking spot me? In the meantime, um, I'm going to be RB to pick my hair because I have some formula in my hair that will help me relax it better. So I'm gonna pick it just to, uh, you know, revitalize it, I guess, so to speak. Anyway, BRB. that I heard that dingle. Is it a Seder? Nope. Same this the same dude. Never mind.
Okay, I am back. Did everyone leave my party because they can't wait? Then again, I didn't really say BRB, did I? Shit. Okay. It's okay, Wonder. We found a new Seder. Thanks for waiting, guys. Let's do this. Oh, you want to take a look at what my summoner has now? She upgraded her gear. Uh, you probably you can't see it here. Let me show you. So, um. Though those who know, know. If you don't, you don't. Uh, Strange Fate Mythic. This shit's gonna be pretty busted, even in 110 cap, from what I've been hearing. So, if you got, if you got your hands on a Strange Fate Mythic, keep it, because 110 cap is uh, <laughs> oh, they're gonna love it. Um, I chose Assassin because it's fucking amazing, and I love Communion, and the other. Uh, the other epics are pretty good as well. It's what the calculator showed me is the best setup I can give myself based on uh, my skill rotation. Thank you, China, for providing me the calculator. My 2A is gone, so I can't use the Awakening. Whew, but did you see how much my 3A did? And I don't even have Roxy! I'm just overall stronger. I did not mean to fucking 3A. Oh my god. Uh, what's the point? 
At least I can two A. Holy shit, he's dead. It's all good. We're gonna finish. Beautiful. Next. If you don't know, now you know. <laughs> I got the reference. And I'm on like 12, 12, part 2 or something. But yeah, I'm on. I'm on part 13. Revealing such an evil soul. I can't surrender at the turning point of destiny. Right now it's to a time. Oh shit. Oh no. I, d I told him specifically. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry whoever was in Craig's party and is not here. I like to get as much done as possible so I chill with the rest of the week. You're the same way, I assume. Fuck yeah. Why do you think I do all? Why do you think I do 15 raids? No matter how busy I am with work and shit, I will always try to find a way to make time for this game. I guess, I guess that's what you call an addiction, huh? <laughs> you will always find a way to make time for whatever it is that you like at the expense of everything else that's going on in life. Damn. Strong addiction. Strong addictions here. Oh well, it is the life I it is the life I made for myself and you know I'm happy. The great thing about life is that there's no there's no there's no right way to to live it. There's just a way. You know? Of course we are the ones who, you know, invented the concepts of right and wrong, so what is right and wrong is, you know, it's really up to humans you ask aliens they'll they they won't know what right and wrong is though they'll, they'll be too busy dissecting you they they, they they don't have concept they don't have moral concept they just they just know what it is that they are programmed to do dissect and research so whether or not it's morally right or wrong is is would not is with is beyond their uh their understanding and comprehension <laughs> so uh get research bitch <laughs>
Of course, that's not to say I don't know what's right and what is wrong. It's just that in this context, I don't care. I I built this life for myself, and I'm gonna I'm gonna live. I'm gonna lay in it. You know. Holy shit, can you fucking die? God damn, is anyone doing damage? Is do we have DI? Then again, Craig's on a kind of a weak-ish character. Holy shit, I'm like dying. No, why did you fucking move, you little bitch? I'm a chopper! Lovely way to finish this off. Next. actually hey you there join us let me see if they will respond holy shit they went in okay well now we're in a predicament where multiple parties existing at once all looking for the same thing a satyr we need a fucking satyr we need a buffer someone who is built a class built on providing buffs and does not do damage seven hours later finally on and off fuck <laughs> oh fuck me 
All right, here we go. We, we can do this. If we can just get one satyr in here, the last run will guarantee a satyr. Big 17's EM train, part 14 out of 15, looking for satyr. Will satyr final round. As a trade-off for you bringing your satyr to my party. There it is. There you go, pork. As always, you bless me so. Let's do this. Let's do this, pork. I should bake some pork chops. Sounds hella good. Lego? When was the last time I had a steak? Quite some time. way but fuck it damn did you see that 2a was that the was that my 2a or was that someone else's skill that did that chunk of damage holy shit Okay, that looked, that looked like my 2A there. Nice damage output. Didn't mean to use that, but fuck it. Just roll my punches. Oh my god, so beautiful. You guys are all so fucking sexy. Uh, did I do the rune prop? Did I do the rune issue again? 
Final round incoming. Yep, I did the rune thing again. Uh, no, we're gonna skip this because copyright. I like the song, but I'm, t I'm tired of my I'm tired of my vods being muted. Uh, let's see. Oh, excuse me. Keep that one. Uh. Holy shit, how many? Thank you. All right, we are approaching the final freaking round of Exile Mountains. Luckily, we only have to do this once, and we're done for the week. Ain't that great, guys? Holy shit. Now watch how many people are going to show up. Because they're like, oh my god, a satyr? 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 Watch that. Watch that. They're going to flock here. Well, I always got to bring my homie Gut Pork. He's been helping me out. I got to help him out, even if it's 10k fame. There's the 15k ba uh, let's say bag carry right there. And... player for oh thank you pork I shall give you blessing thanks pork I could use the help there Runes, 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 runes. Gotta craft those runes, baby. Please stop forgetting. seconds before I boot your ass because I know you've been trying to apply to this shit over and 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 fucking over again I honestly was hoping that the 30 seconds would pass fuck me oh well I'll make it work I swear if he lags I'm gonna get really upset I feels bad. I play with my characters early in the morning. What you feeling bad for, Rev? I, I got I got homies. I got homies. I got more than just you. I got homies everywhere. Guild? Fucking random people who, who just so happens to be aligned with what I need, you know? P -p people show up. This game ain't dead. No matter what the memes say, this game is not dead. There's plenty of people to help you out. Especially if you have good rep, you know. I think I have relatively good rep. Since I'm hosting a train, it makes it easier to find more people. I'm not a one and done kind of person. You feel me? You feel me? Okay, you feel me? Alright, you understand. Alright, let's go. Uh maybe I don't need to maybe I don't need to go to the uh She Forget the garden, I don't need it. 
I don't need the garden at all. Don't need it. I was considering. I don't think I need it. Okay, so she got it. Cool. God, there's a lot of people who speak Korean. I'm assuming it's Korean. If I am wrong, please. Just please. <laughs> That's all. Uh, we're fucking dead. Yikes. I'll resurrect. this song too but copyright I'm so sorry one punch man I'm just going through my playlist I have a gaming playlist and then I have like a playlist that's for you know my other music my hip-hop and R&B and electro and shit like that and EDM you know that music You're, you're, you, you can die. You're not like not like you're doing anything. Owie, owie, owie. What the freak? Thank you. Oh my sh Holy shit, can you stop being at the fucking corner and die like a man? Thank you. This is where you die. Awesome. Yum 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 yum. Wonderful. See y'all another time. Alright. It took an hour 37 minutes, but I think an hour 37 minutes is a pretty fast time to clear 15 exiles, wouldn't you say? Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Woo! Now... Ugh, what was I about to do? Oh yeah. So. We need to finish up on Yachi, because what he has right now is not going to cut it. This is just the beginning work. This is just the groundwork. There are still some more things that need to be done on this guy, as you can uh, <laughs> clearly see. So, uh, yeah, let's get started. We'll start with the enchantments. And the girl who manages that is Kituri. She's actually my richest character since 
I sell cards on her and she manages the money, the finances, so to speak. So she determines whose turn is it to get upgrades. And right now it is Yachi's turn. So let's get that shit dealt with, shall we? Uh, so we were going to use Red Ghost Saurian because right now this is the enchant. This is one of the... This is one of the like higher tier enchantments that is the cheapest right now. So going fire damage is actually cheaper. It's like the cheapest elemental enchant out of all the others. Um, I'm not going for the one that's better than this, so I'm just gonna have to stick with Silvery Harbor. You know, Direct Hitter, Woodsworth, shit like that. They're both max upgraded. I need to get these max upgraded. So what is the cheapest legendary card to get at the moment? <laughs> Uh, let's see, card, search by legendaries, please. Is it still, uh... No, that's the most expensive. What's the cheapest? Huh. This is cheaper than Mask Knight? Where's Mask Knight at? There's no fucking way. There's no way that this is the cheapest. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. Why? Why? Mask and I, how much are you? Is it because Mask and I doesn't show up th this way? Do I have to like search for it manually? You're not even really all that far off. Wow. That's impressive. So Mask Knight card is around the same price as a Red Ghost Saurian. This further proves that fire slash light damage is the cheapest element to enchant. So that's what we're doing. Plus, Yachi was already fire damage anyway, so. Uh Oh wait, no, I don't actually I don't I don't see why this doesn't show up. Is it because it can't be upgraded? Is that why? I don't know. How about we how about we choose all? Let's go. Let's let's just reset. Reset. Go to enchant card. I'm gonna go for all. Anything that's legendary. There we go. That that's why it didn't show up, because I had it for reinforce. Oh no, it was still there. Oh shit. So this is cheaper by eight thousand eight hundred and ninety seven. I mean eight thousand eight hundred and eighty seven, which ain't shit, but Still cheaper. Interesting. So, uh... Well, before we do that, hold on a minute. Who has the most... Who has the most, uh, antimatters right now? Because I need to get, like... I need to get a lot, so... I'm not really in a position to just spend them all immediately, you know? Like, I'm not in a position to just spend all my money willy-nilly like this. You, you, you feel me? Um, how many ways were there for me to get... Uh, I still have my... I still have my account-bound special antimatters. And I believe it's one... Okay, you know what? We'll do that. Use the account-bound shit first. And then spend money. That's why these are here. These are here for the sole purpose of using them. So, what is 150 times... Hold on a minute. 15, 30, 45, 60, 75, 90. I'm going to withdraw 900 of these. If I'm lucky, if I'm lucky, it will only take 900 antimatter particles to max out all three red ghost orients. So, uh,. Wait, what am I? Oh, oh, I remember. I think I remember. Yeah, 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 I remember what I was doing. I, for a minute, I, I like brain farted. We did this to get uh, however many. Two, four, six, twelve. Wait, what? I can only get six. Uh, did I do my math wrong? Was it was it supposed to be eighteen hundred? Shit! 
shit, it was. It was supposed to be 1800. Fuck. Because I forgot they, they both need to be upgraded twice. Alright, so let me scratch that. If I'm lucky, it will take only 1800 antimatter particles to completely... That's 30 million abort cell cards instead. No, I don't want to sell. I mean, you you know what? Technically, I could. Hold on a minute. Hold on a second. You got you have a good idea. Hold on a second. I just remembered something. <laughs> Where's this bitch at? Uh, there you are. If I just upgrade you to max and sell you, I add that I I make I make up all the money I spent. So, actually, hold on. Aren't you don't don't aren't you worth shit? Isn't this card worth shit if you max it? I think so. Vita of Mercy. How much are you worth when you're maxed? A max upgraded Vita of Mercy is 28 mil. Better than what it is? Better than what it is now. Anyway, let's um let's start with Red Leg, you feel me? Let's get red leg out the way. Sick. Now do it again, please. Do it one more time. One more time for daddy! Woo! Give me my fucking money. You're only worth 39? Man, what? You're not that far off from Vita. Red leg. There, wait, hold on. Red leg doesn't even exist in the auction. I can, I can create the price. Shit. In that case, fuck 39 million. No, you gonna buy this bitch for 45 million. Bitch. Give me my fucking money. Bitch. Anyway. Now that we got that out the way. Um, what's 900 minus, what's 1800 minus 300, 1500, okay, so I need 1500, I need, uh, I need 600 more of this, damn, I'm really cutting into my special antimatters, but it must be done, it must be done, it must be done, I am so sorry, and whatever's left over, I can always just use for other characters, you feel, so, Alrighty, just give me 10. Alright, 12. If I'm lucky, if I'm lucky, it will only take 12 Mask Knight cards. By the way, how much how much would these be if I sold all 12? How much money would I get? Roughly 58 million. Anyway, let's get started. I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna look if it's success or failure. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna press escape the moment I I can. I don't think that was a, I don't think that that worked. Yeah, fuck. I, I actually you know fuck it. I'll just check. I'm not a pussy. Oh my god, two failures. Dude, what are you doing? Stop that. Thank you. Fucking get your act together. Now, I need you to max this one to make it up to me. Yo, what's going on here? What's going on here? What What are you doing? Stop that, please. Please, 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 please. What are you doing? Fuck. That means I need... Another 450. Fuck. This stinks. 450. Okay. Oops. Excuse me. Come on. Come on, girl. Wait, hold on. Wait, what? Yeah. 
Hold up, which alt is it for now? This is for Yachi. This is Yachi's upgrades. This is Yachi's upgrades. This is Yachi's upgrades. How much do I have right now? 132, once 159 is 18. I need 18 more of these. Okay. Move, bitch. Thank you. All right, try this again. Please, please don't fuck this up for me. Thank you. Okay, now get this bitch. Okay, we just gotta do it one more time. So, God, you see, you see how much resources this costs. I mean, I I could buy a max, but you know, I would like to save my money for a rainy day. You feel? Um. Fuck, I forgot about the earrings too. I gotta do that as well. Fuck me. Okay, we'll get one of these. I forgot about that. We have to get that taken care of as well. Uh. God, I'm using up a lot of resources, guys. I need another 450. This is no joke. All right, the, the last one out. The last one I'm gonna buy because I, I feel like I spent too much money. The last one I'm gonna. The last card I'm gonna buy. Uh, Apostle obsessed Saurian. Sure. Come on. Thank you. And lastly, this one. Yeah, I only need to upgrade it once. Just make it happen, please. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. So, we have Yachi's neck. Uh, Yachi's accessories are good. Yachi's earring is good. His top and bottom are good. I need a shoulder and I need a belt enchant and I need shoes enchant. So in terms of what we have currently for the shoes, where was hyperspeed, blah, 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 where I just saw you. Hyperspeed, uh, movement speed 7%. Yes, I will take it over crit because I'm pretty sure Yachi will be max crit without it. Um, give me, give me ice dragon. Give me this and give me this. Alright. We're just going we're just going with some random fod unique fodder that I know I won't use ever again. No, keep that. Ho oh, ho, keep that one. Alright, shoes are good. Belts. What are some good belt enchants right now? Belt enchants. Absorbing Tanakar gives strength 50. Worm Dischamps gives strength 40. This one gives strength and crit, and this one gives strength 50. So both of you give strength 50. Which one's cheaper? I'm sure you're fucking expensive. Yeah, 11 mil, fuck. And I'm sure absorbing, absorbing Tana is probably uh, just as harsh. Yeah, you're like more expensive. I think you're more expensive because you're just, I don't know. Oh, because you, you're you're already maxed. You can't be upgraded. There. Where do you where do you get this anyway? Is it from squad mode, Sirico, or something? I've never seen this card before. Uh, damn. How about we do this? How about we do this? Oops. Hold on. Before I decide anything on the shoulder and the belt, because I know that those are usually uh, 
Those are usually given for crit. Let us send all these over to Yachi and see where his crit is as of right now. Oh yeah, I could I could use the Oh shit, hold on a minute. You're right. Wait, wait, wait a second. I could get even richer. Thank you for reminding me. Where is it? I know I have one, right? Don't I? Hold on. Or did I sell it? Fuck, I don't have the Sirico card anymore. I used to have a Sirico card, but I don't have it. I think I sold it. Fuck. Fuck. Alright, whatever. Whatever, it's fine. I'm sure I'll get another one uh, eventually. Maybe. Oh, I could. Oh, I could have just used this. Wait, Venta on the road. How much are you worth? You're you're the best movement speed uh, enchantment. How much are you worth? Really? You're 2.1 mil. Should I feel like you should be more expensive than that? Especially if you're giving 10 movement speed. Oh well, whatever. Um, Yachi, come and get your goodies, my friend. Get ready because you are gonna need a lot of your high-grade elemental crystals. Let's just get 500 for a starting point. And we're gonna need some mana solvents as well. Mana solvents are fucking expensive, but I'll just get a nice, uh... I'll get a nice 300 to start. Get your goodies. Bam, 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 bam. Are you guys appreciative of this? Because I swear, I, 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 it's been a hot minute since I've ever done any upgrade related streams. Now then, everything that is not the shoulder and the belt can get the fuck out. And as you can see, I also got majority of these are amplified, so I did some, you know, like I, I had to look through my safe and find all the epics that I kept that were already tainted, and let's just say a lot of money was spent, so <laughs> uh, this guy can be, Rayad, I did it, I cleared BP2 solo play, 13k fame DPS, holy shit, was it squad mode or like the legitimate uh, BP2? You couldn't find you couldn't find anyone. You didn't have to go through that shit. But grats on you, dude. Holy fuck. All right, let's put some best enchant best slot enchantments on this bitch, shall we? Yes, sir. Give me another one. Yes, sir. And one more. Yes, sir. Uh. I don't. Yes, sir. We still need to get a sub equipment and magic stone enchant. What is a good magic stone enchant? Um, holy, wait, hold on a minute. I think I know one. I need to switch characters for this. I could go the prey Isis route. I could go the prey Isis route and get 20 elemental damage, but let me let me see here for a minute. Give me a minute for it. Give me a minute. How much is a Oh god, your price went extremely low. 49... 4.9 mil, huh? Damn. Prey really went down. This shit used to be worth like 20 fucking million. Where, what's that other one? Revealed Ruinous Barius. You are... 
9 million, but you give more elemental damage. Hmm. 19 minutes of pain, goddamn. Hmm. What should I do, guys? You know, I should probably... Mm, nah, I don't know. I'll, I'll stick with what I already have in the safe, shall we? So we'll do that. This is my magic stone. Now, I need a good sub-equipment. What is a good sub-equipment to wear? Um, fuck. Good sub equipment. No, wrong one. If it ain't red leg, it's pure blood despero. And you get 55. And then there's the god of chaos, Ozma. Which you only need to upgrade twice, but. I'm sure I have the money to get it, like... It's not that I can't afford it, it's just... Do I really want to spend 51 million? I don't think so. We'll do the next best thing, we'll get the, uh, what's his name, pure... Blood... Pure Blood Despero. You are only 3.2 million and you require two upgrades. So yeah, let's let's go for the let's go for the the next best route, the the cheaper route. You feel? Until something comes up. I mean, you're already going all in. Just finish it. I mean, but it's on Yachi though. Even Rayot doesn't have even Rayot doesn't have a, a Rayot nor Clayo have the God of Destruction Ozma card enchantment. So why would I put it on Yachi of all people? I'm not saying that Yachi ain't gonna be built. It's just that Yachi's built to be you know sustainability. I don't. <sighs> I don't know. I mean, I'm not getting Red Leg. That's just too expensive right now. I'd, ra I'd rather use red legs to make money so I can get the shit that I really want. I'm not going to buy a red leg. I'd rather just get the, the something that's like the next closest thing. Which is, in this case, pure blood despair. Um, oh yeah. Uh, let me choose any fucking random ass fodder. You get you get to be upgraded twice, so uh, Wait, are these? Wait, hold on. Let me stop that for a minute. Let me get something that I know won't. No, that, that actually makes some good money too. Hold on a minute. I gotta think about this for a second. What I'm what I'm actually getting rid of. I need something that's truly fodder. Okay, this one. Okay, I have ten of these motherfuckers. I get Midnight's Darkness so fucking much here that I can actually just use all of these, but I'm only gonna use two for now. Just for now. And it's account bound, so I can't sell it. If I have multiple account bound things, I'm just gonna use those priority, especially if they're useless. So, pure blood. Cool. 
it one more time for the boys in the back. And there we go. Right, I need to upgrade Prey, don't I? How about we use Beast Rim? Like an account bound version of Beast Rim. Right? I can do that. Just Beast Rim. Not like, not like I'm gonna put it on any other fucking Seder. All my other Seders are much better suited for other things. I don't have anything I don't have any other legendary cards that are account bound. So, in this case, I will cough up another 300 of these. No, actually no, 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 fuck that. Fuck that. Fuck that. I'm going to need it for another rainy day. We're just going to buy uh we're just going to buy two more legendary cards. Alright, in this case, two Vita of Mercies. There. Don't fucking fail. Do not fucking fail. Do not fucking fail. Do not fucking fail. Do not fail. Please. Appreciate it. Okay. Where's my other Vita of Mercy? I thought I, I thought I bought another one. There we go. All right, just do it again, please. Do not fail. Do not fail. Do not fail. Do not fail. Do not fail, please. Thank you. I love you. All right. <sighs> Don't I have a blue witch card? Search. Blue. Yeah, there you are. Is that so? I beg to differ. Now we're talking. How many times do you have to upgrade Blue Witch? You have to upgrade it twice. Anyway. Give this to you. I should have enough mana solvents to go all the way. And then one more. All right. Equip everything. And all we're left to do is to get an enchantment for the belt and the shoulder. Oh, by the way, hold on a second. Plate armor, plate armor, plate armor, leather, leather. Okay. We need to get these three retexturized to leather. Where is... I don't have enough money to do that. 
Gateri, I'm gonna need you to uh, deposit like three million for me, please. Deposit a nice three million so that Yachi can eat some food. Are you done with DFO after this? I'm gonna crash out soon. Um, I mean, you, 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 you can go. You can go, Wonder. You can go, Wonder. Like, uh, I, I'll be done streaming after I'm done upgrading. Use the event ones. What, what event ones? Event of, uh, event ones of who? Oh, you mean the, uh, I know what you mean. The, the event epics. The event epics. Um, the problem is... This is an event epic, but it still needs to be retexturized, and these two are from the safe. I don't have any. I do not have any event. Uh, I do not have any event uh, epics of these versions. I only have one of each of these kinds. So yeah. Anyway, we we'll draw this. Leather, 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 leather. Give me what's eight times three? Twenty-four. Give me two hundred and forty of this. I'm pretty certain one of you can retexturize. I forgot who. Uh, surely one of you can retexturize. Hold on a minute. Can none of you do it? Wait, is it the Grail? Is it the Grail? Holy shit! No one here can retexturize. Okay, I'm, I'm out of here. Bye. I could have sworn someone there could retexturize. Um, I gotta talk to my guy. Roger. You can retexturize. Give me... Superior Leather, 240 of these, please. It still costs 500k to retexturize. Every single time, I would like to remind you. Like, that, that, that hurts. It hurts to retexturize like that. Uh, what what actually changes? I mean, nothing really changes. It's just that my spirit goes up. My strength is still the same. The intelligence is still the same. So it's just the passive. I'm getting I'm getting some passive bonuses off of it because of Ghost Blaze Leather Armor Mastery. All right. While we are here, my crit sits at 93.2% in town. In town, by the way. So if I go into uh, some dungeon, let's say uh, a nice uh, inner castle. Let's check what my... Did you know the event gives three retext for free? Yeah, that's what I was trying to tell him. Oh, shit. Really? Oh, well... <laughs> Uh, I guess I'll just, I guess I'll just give it to Seraphonite then. She's my next, uh, project to upgrade. I actually did not know that. Whoops. MB. Sorry, guys. I, I didn't, I didn't know what you were trying to tell me. Um, so my crit is still at 93.2. Does it ever change? Like, is there anything about my gear that increases my crit? I'm just gonna spam a lot of skills until I feel something changes. Nope, still sits at 93.2. Which means all I need is 7% more crit, and I'll be good. Hmm. 7%, huh? Is there really no other way it, my crit can be increased? Is it, is it, does it really just sit at 93.2? Forever? Uh. Switch this one. Ninety-three point two, huh? I have an idea. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> didn't mean to do that. Oh well. I got an idea, y'all. I have a slight idea on what I can do to give myself max crit and give myself the most strength possible. I'm gonna have to make use of those hybrid. Oh, actually, hold on. Hold on a minute. Okay, so this is Max. Avatar. Oh, wait. Hold on a second. Mmm. Fuck. I forgot about these. I forgot about this. I forgot about this. Mm hmm. 
So actually, my crit is going to be, once I actually update these, my crit is actually going to be much lower than what it currently is right now. My crit is actually going to be lower. Because I forgot that Yachi has these, uh, he just has pure physical crit chance in, uh, in chance. I mean, uh, emblems. And I need to change that because that's not what I want for endgame. You need strength, physical crit, hybrid. Now I know, I do know that there is the selective gold emblem socket that I could use on Yachi, but I feel like that is a waste. I could get something that is much better. So this, so I, I basically I have a plan, y'all. Hold on, I have a plan. All right. It is gonna require me to spend more money. Please, hold on. Isn't there like a selective like gold emblem box I can buy right now or something? Is there a gold emblem box I can buy? Gold emblem. Okay, how about this? Selective. Fuck. Oh, Lord have mercy, I'm not buying this shit. That's stupid. I'm not doing that. Alrighty then. Um, strength plus physical crit. How much are you worth right now? 4.4 million each, and I need three of these. You know what? I will buy that. I'll buy it. I'll buy it. I'll buy two of these. Yeah, I, th I might invest in my Ghost Blade too now. You've convinced me, but then again, I'll be alting. <laughs> I know, right? All right, so I'll buy three of these. Thank you. Yachi has now fixed his... Uh, strength problem. Wait, hold on a minute. I do need strength, don't I? Uh, please don't be expensive. You're 10 million each? Nope, not doing it. Not gonna do that. Not gonna do that. Nope, suck my ass. Not gonna do that. Absolutely no. Absolutely not. I am not going to spend fucking... Like, keep in mind, gold emblems for strength, you're putting that in a lot of slots. You're putting that in a lot of slots. Like, eight slots can have that. This can have it. 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 That's already two, four, six, eight, ten slots of your fucking uh, avatar that can have a gold emblem for, for a, a stat only. And since it's ten million each... Fuck no, I'm not doing that. You got me fucked up. Absolutely not. No, I refuse. Anyway. All right. Bam. We are going to replace pure crit with strength plus crits. Yes. Thank you. We are going to use one more for this one. And replace the silver one with this one. Now, this will make my crit lower. My crit is now 89.5, which means it is basically 90. I have the perfect enchant for that. I wonder how much you are worth. Uh, worth. Worth. This guy right here. This guy gives a physical crit chance of 10%, the exact amount that I need to finish my shit. Or, or, I could go the alternative route. And get two Shattering Rotos. It actually makes makes more sense. It's oh wait no this is head and shoulder only fuck never mind. Um, I thought it was head shoulder belt and shoes. Shit. So 
so what's what's for bell fuck that means i have to uh Can you blame Q Killer for the emblem prices? Probably. He's the king of emblems, but he might be on a hiatus. Good. Stay on a fucking hiatus. I don't need you ass. How much was Nameless Gatekeeper again? How much was Na Nameless Gatekeeper again? Hold on. Fuck! I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. But I want to! But fucking 11 million. Ugh. Don't I have one? Hold on a minute. Don't I have one? Fuck! I don't think I do. Where would I find it? Strength, hold on. Strength 25, physical crit plus 6. Okay. That would leave me at 4 more percent. Is there any enchantment? Is there any enchantment for a shoe that gives me strength and crit, but uh, shoes only? Uh, crit. Fuck! Wait, actually, yeah, this is it. So why would I buy you? You are crit only. Hmm. You're already one out of two, though. Wait, that makes no sense. Who would... Why would you pay... Who's messing with... Okay, who's messing with this market, y'all? You see? Are you seeing this problem here? Chaos Eaton K at an already one out of two upgrade is cheaper than no upgraded Chaos Eaton K. Because that, because that makes sense, right? That makes, that makes no sense. These numbers should be flipped upside down. Anyway, I, I think I have an idea. I have an idea, y'all. Watch, watch this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make the most out, out of it. I'm going to need, I'm gonna need you. Um, no, actually, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get this one. I don't, I don't mind. Okay, seven. That makes ten. And then my rotos. Bam. Wait, no, no, fuck. No, 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 no. It's pointless to have you. What's the strongest shoulder that gives me the most strength? It's there's this and then there's the one that's 11 million and I'd rather just go for the pussyfoot route and just get this one. So yeah, these are the three. This is what we'll do. We're going to get Chaos Eaton K for the belts specifically. This for the shoes, which will put me at 10% crit, 
which means I'll be maxed. And then this for raw power on the shoulder. Uh, yeah. And every single one of these are unique. Which means I can spam six of these. Yep. If I'm lucky, I will only need to use six. I didn't have to spend... Uh, I didn't really have to spend much. So upgrade card, please. Chaos Eaton K, we need you upgraded at maximum, please. Thank you, you're so sexy. All right, who wants to join the upgrade train? And remember, I'm using these because they're already they are account bound and they're they're like pointless for me at this point. All righty, Worm to Champs, give me. It was only, it had to be that one. You had to be that guy. You had to be that guy. This is why you're dead. This is why you're dead. I'll use Druid Mia, because Druid Mia would never betray me. The cute girls will always make sure that your cards are upgraded. Ain't that right, Druid Mia? Show them how it's done. Okay, fuck you too. You're a bitch. Actual thought. I have I actually have a lot of these, so I could use another two. Surely you can do it. Surely you won't fuck up three times. Whoops. Surely you can't fuck up three times in a row. Like, surely. Thank you. Holy fucking shit. What Roko said do I want? Assassin. That's what he's gonna get. He's gonna wear Assassin. I want to be fast. I want to be consistent. I don't care about my overall power. Like, like uh, Yachi has way too much, you know, multi-hit damage on, in his kit to be a burst. I'm not going to build him burst. I'm going to build him sustain. And since the Chinese calculator wants to give me bullshit every single time I try to calculate for him, like for some reason, for some reason when I use the Chinese calculator, every time I try to calculate for a ghost blade any ghost blade it crashes but when i want to do it for any other character it doesn't crash but for some reason for the ghost blade it does i don't know if it happens to anyone else um but yeah that, that that's what that's just what's been happening for me and it's kind of annoying you know let me see if my calculations are correct they should be i went through all this trouble uh better not be incorrect Oop, da -da 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 -da. reset 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 I would like some mana solvents, please. Uh, give me 90. I think 90 is a good amount. Mm. Give me 150 of you. Oops, wrong area. How you doing, Blinkish? I come to make a bargain. This is for what again? The shoulder. The shoulder. The shul- Oh my god. So unfortunately we did we did end up wasting the uh, the hyperspeed Zalakine because I, I'm not gonna get movement speed, I'm gonna get something different now. Oh, whoops. No, 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 no. Don't do that. Don't do that. Wrong. This is for the belt. This is for the belt. Remember? Correct. Now, the shoes was going to have this one. Correct. And last but not least, for the shoulder. All right, we now have strength 40, physical attack 50, strength 20, physical crit 7, physical attack 50, strength 20, strength 25, physical crit 3, 30, 30, 30, 